Christian von Kunisig, the mysterious founder and CEO of high-performance car manufacturer Kunisig, has recently drawn attention with a bold statement that has shaken the automotive world. During a secret event surrounded by mystery and to which only hand-picked journalists, automotive experts and industry insiders were invited, he presented revolutionary engine technology that he claims could change the future of automobiles and perhaps make electric vehicles obsolete. With his characteristic charismatic approach and forward-thinking vision, Christian von Kunisig presented a compelling argument that this new engine could be a true breakthrough, not only for his company but for the entire automotive industry. If you're wondering whether this technology could truly revolutionize how we think about cars and sustainability, the surprising developments revealed later in this story might just change your perspective on the future of transportation. Before we continue, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to never miss an update. Your support gives strength to our channel. And also check out the link in the description for our exciting channel giveaway that you won't want to miss. The event was organized in a dramatic setting, an elegant and futuristic venue that emphasized the innovative nature of the announcement. From the beginning, it became evident that this was not simply a product update or a new iteration, but a bold leap into the unknown. Kunisig, known for his unwavering confidence and deep technical knowledge, took the stage to present what he called the next generation internal combustion engine, which combines the efficiency and ecological benefits of electric cars with the power and performance traditionally associated with gasoline engines. This statement was truly revolutionary. The new engine, which Kunisig has named the free valve light speed engine, is based on free valve technology, a concept the company has been working on for several years. Unlike traditional engines that use a camshaft to open and close intake and exhaust valves, the free valve engine uses pneumatic actuators to independently control the valves. This allows for much more precise control of air and fuel flow, resulting in significant improvements in power, efficiency and emissions. However, the light speed engine takes this concept to an entirely different level. It is lighter, more compact and more powerful than any internal combustion engine on the market while promising energy efficiency and emission levels that can compete with those of electric vehicles. One of the most striking aspects of this new engine is its versatility. Unlike traditional internal combustion engines that are generally optimized for a specific type of fuel, the light speed engine can operate with various types of fuel including ethanol, methanol and synthetic fuels. This ability to adapt to different fuel types provides a compelling solution to the carbon emissions problem, particularly if renewable or low carbon fuel sources are used. Christian von Kunisig quickly pointed out that this adaptability could serve as intermediate technology, helping to reduce emissions until the world transitions from fossil fuels to a more sustainable energy future. Beyond the technical specifications, what truly sets this engine apart is its potential to disrupt the electric vehicle market. The growing interest in electric vehicles has been primarily driven by concerns related to climate change and the desire to reduce dependence on fossil fuels. However, Kunisig argued that electric vehicles have their own drawbacks, such as range, charging infrastructure, and the environmental impact of battery production and disposal, which raise concerns about the long-term viability of electric vehicles as a global solution. The light speed engine, with its combination of efficiency, low emissions and high performance, could offer a compelling alternative that solves many of these problems without the limitations associated with electric powertrains. The impact of this new technology on the automotive industry is profound. The announcement suggests that the internal combustion engine, often considered a relic of the past, could still play an important role in the future of transportation. This discovery could prompt a review of strategies from car manufacturers many of which have invested considerable sums in the development and infrastructure of electric vehicles. The possibility of reviving advanced internal combustion technologies, especially those that can compete with or even surpass the ecological benefits of electric vehicles, could lead to significant changes in industry strategies and investments. Christian von Kunisig's presentation also addressed the economic and practical advantages of the light speed engine. He asserted that although electric vehicles are becoming increasingly accessible, the cost of batteries and the need for extensive charging infrastructure remain major obstacles, particularly in less developed regions. In contrast, an internal combustion engine as efficient and clean as an electric vehicle could utilize existing infrastructure, making it a more accessible option for a wider range of consumers. This potential for democratizing high efficiency, low emission technologies could have far reaching consequences, particularly in emerging markets where high initial costs and logistical issues related to the adoption of electric vehicles remain significant barriers. 
The event continued with a live demonstration of the engine's capabilities, showing its impressive power and responsiveness performance. Participants witnessed a series of tests where the engine's performance was compared to both traditional internal combustion engines and leading electric powertrains. The results were astonishing. The light speed engine demonstrated acceleration and torque rivaling or surpassing the performance of some of the most powerful electric hypercars on the market, while maintaining energy efficiency unthinkable for an internal combustion engine just a few years ago. The audience, composed of both skeptics and enthusiasts, was clearly impressed, and a palpable excitement quickly spread throughout the room. However, it was not just the technical qualities of the engine that left a strong impression. Christian von Kunisig's strategic vision for the future of his company and the automotive industry as a whole was equally fascinating. He presented a roadmap for integrating the light-speed engine into the new generation of Kunisig cars, each combining the traditional aesthetics of supercars with cutting-edge technologies and sustainability. According to him, the future of high-performance cars is not a choice between electric and internal combustion, but rather a synthesis that harnesses the best features of both options. This hybrid approach could offer a new path for the industry that would be both sustainable and exciting. The announcement also sparked intense discussions among automotive experts and industry analysts. Some perceived it as a potential turning point in the debate between electric vehicles and internal combustion engines, while others were more cautious, noting that although the technology promises much, its success will depend on several factors, including regulatory approval, consumer acceptance, and the ability of Kunisig to scale its production. The company's history of innovation and niche success suggests it has the potential to overcome these obstacles, but there are still significant challenges before the light-speed engine can be considered a viable alternative to electric vehicles. Despite the skepticism, the announcement has undoubtedly revived new interest in the potential of internal combustion engines, particularly among enthusiasts who have long complained about the alleged decline of automotive passion in the era of electric vehicles. For many, the roar of the engine, the smell of burnt fuel, and the palpable excitement of high-speed driving are integral parts of the automotive experience, and they see in the light-speed engine a way to preserve this heritage while meeting modern demands for efficiency and sustainability. Christian von Kunisig, with his flair for drama and insatiable desire for innovation, captured this spirit by presenting a future where performance and sustainability are not opposing goals. The potential consequences of this announcement are enormous. If the light-speed engine delivers on its promises, it could become a catalyst for a new era of innovation in the automotive industry, encouraging other manufacturers to explore alternative paths to sustainability beyond electric vehicles. This could also have an impact on the political landscape, with governments and regulators reassessing their focus on electrification in light of these new technological developments. This could pave the way for a more diversified approach to reducing automobile emissions, including not only electric vehicles but also advanced internal combustion technologies, hydrogen fuel cells, and other promising solutions. For Kunisig, the stakes are at their highest. The company has built its reputation on pushing the boundaries of automotive engineering, and the success of the light-speed engine will be decisive in maintaining its position at the forefront of the automotive industry. Christian von Kunisig's unshakable faith in his concept and his desire to challenge the status quo have set the stage for one of the most significant technological battles in the history of the automotive industry. Although the outcome remains uncertain, one thing is clear. The automotive landscape will never be the same again. Christian von Kunisig's bold declaration at the event has not only shaken the automotive world but has also launched a broader discussion on the future of mobility. With the launch of the light-speed engine, Kunisig has consolidated its position as a serious player in a market that many thought was irrevocably destined for electrification. However, the story does not end with the technical characteristics of the revolutionary engine. It opens a complex narrative related to market dynamics, consumer preferences, the regulatory landscape, and technological innovations. To understand the significance of this statement, one must examine the broader context in which it was made. The automotive industry stands at a critical crossroads, with traditional manufacturers and disruptive newcomers vying for position in an increasingly complex marketplace. The conventional wisdom has been that electric vehicles represent the inevitable future, with internal combustion engines gradually being phased out as environmental regulations tighten. Kunisig's announcement challenges this established narrative, suggesting that the path forward may not be as straightforward as previously thought. By introducing a technology that potentially combines the best aspects of both worlds, von Kunisig is not merely offering an alternative product, but proposing an alternative vision for the industry's evolution. This vision resonates particularly strongly with automotive enthusiasts and traditionalists, 
who have viewed the shift toward electrification with a mixture of resignation and dismay. For them, the light speed engine represents not just a technological innovation, but a cultural lifeline, preserving the sensory and emotional elements of driving that many fear will be lost in an electric future. The technical merits of the light speed engine, while impressive, are only part of the equation. The true test will be in its real-world implementation and acceptance by consumers, regulators, and the broader industry. Will the promised efficiency and performance materialize in production vehicles? Can the technology be scaled cost-effectively? Will regulatory frameworks evolve to accommodate this hybrid approach to sustainability? These questions remain unanswered, but the mere fact that they are now being asked signals a significant shift in the conversation. For an industry that has been increasingly converging on electrification as the sole path forward, the introduction of a credible alternative opens up new possibilities and challenges established assumptions. Christian von Kunisig's reputation as an industry visionary adds weight to his claims, but even the most brilliant visionaries can be wrong or ahead of their time. The coming months and years will reveal whether the light speed engine represents a genuine paradigm shift or simply an interesting detour on the road to an electric future. What is certain is that by making this bold announcement, Kunisig has ensured that the debate continues, keeping alive the possibility that the internal combustion engine, with sufficient innovation, might yet have a role to play in our sustainable transportation future. As we watch this story unfold, one thing remains clear. The passion for automobiles that has driven innovation for over a century continues unabated, finding new expressions and new champions even as the technological landscape shifts beneath our feet.